Well, I've been working in the Wisconsin aerospace market for 35 plus years. I spent my whole career in international for my previous company, and when we founded Badger Technology, we immediately focused on that. We are thrilled that Badger Technology Group is being recognized this year as an Governor's Export Achievement Award winner. They realized that there were opportunities in international markets from the get-go. We provide services, we write software, we integrate other people's products. For example, we'll build a simulator which consists of elements from our suppliers. We'll provide an integrated aircraft system with parts from maybe as many as 40 suppliers. But service drives what, what we do. 86% of their revenue is derived from international markets, and we want other Wisconsin companies to realize that there are opportunities for their products and services. Uh, in fact, in 2022, aerospace exports uh, were our seventh top product category for the state. I highly recommend that most companies should look at the world as a small place and should go after international business. There's a lot of markets out that are looking for products and think highly of products that are coming from the state of Wisconsin. Challenges are pretty consistent across the board for expanding into international markets, but we do want companies to know that there are tools available to them. WEDC is a good resource for companies that are familiar with, it, with international marketing, but also want to learn more about it. We have an international market grant program that provides a total of $150,000. We also have our network of in-country trade reps who can provide services such as market assessments and partner searches. We're in the running for several major international upgrade programs that will create potentially 100 jobs here uh, overnight. It's part of our DNA to be here in Wisconsin and, and uh, that will be significant growth. 